Hey, what's up, guys? It's Jack from here. Now, this is maybe a really weird and old video, but I was watching uh, Michael from Achievement Hunter playing his Banjo Kazooie uh, Let's Play, and I thought I might go and try out Banjo Tui, and I found out it's actually a pretty kick ass game. So, this is uh, one of the bosses I actually had really, really big trouble with, so I thought I might just make a video just in case any of you had the same idea. So, you start off in the level. Go through the big ass doors you open and go straight into the aircon plant. Took me a while to uh, find out how to open this door that I'm about to go into. Can't really remember how to do it, but. Well, I'm sure if you're watching this and you've already done it, I'm trying to figure out how to do it. So you go into this repair depot. I've already been in here, so that's why you don't have to go for that little cutscene. That's why he's uh, posting about how he's beating me. So you start off, he's pretty slow, so if you uh, you don't even really need to use a Kazooie to uh, sprint very far, so you just just keep on rolling really to keep out of his blue balls. And when he does that little sucky thing, as you saw, turn around and shoot a grenade, and he sucks it up and he explodes into him. And you see these uh, little red kind of like uh, planks or plates around him? I believe there are six of them. So you have to do that uh, explosion six times to get all of them destroyed, which uh, which is mostly you know the norm from all bosses. So then once you do that, he sends out these little like uh, no what they're called like spaces or shit like that. I don't know. So then you do that again. It's pretty simple, but I don't know. I just, I have very trouble trying to complete this. And here's this fucking thing that's so annoying. As you can see, he jumped up there, and a good way to do it is just just keep on running, as, and you can see his shadow getting uh, bigger and bigger and bigger, and as long as you're not underneath the shadow, there's no way he can hurt you, even if you're right beside it. Chases you, does it. Gives up. And just keep on doing this. Most of uh, It's pretty simple. Uh, it's getting really pissed now, I think. Now this is where it starts to get difficult. All these lines between the uh, plates on the floor, oh damn it, first hit rather, right start to get electrocuted. So there's no way to really walk over them, you have to keep on jumping or, just as I'm doing, which is really easy, stay in the same square. See, you saw there. You can get really, really close to him without him sucking you, uh, sucking you up. Now, uh, once again, he sends out his little minions. These, this is a good point, just in case um, you've started to lose health like I have. This is a chance to kill these guys and um, get some health back. Now that is what happens if you're a moron and not quick enough with the uh, grenades. Which I, I don't think is really that bad, because then he sends out these things, which means I can get a honeycomb back. Take out these little guys. That's another little tip, if you can't, if you don't want to have to jump over all the uh, little electrocuted spikes, just shoot them from afar. Once again, jumping up, as you can see a shadow following me there. Getting bigger and bigger, and there we go. Just keep on moving, that's all you can, don't even have to do the uh, Kazooie sprint, just keep on running. Oh, I've only just noticed that there's a little countdown in there, it's how many times you have to hit him. <laughs> that could have uh, made it a bit easier. Well, so I learned something there. So there you go. Last little hit, and he uh, explodes. Good little marked nut moment. Destroying that power cable. Alright, there we go. I li I also, little uh, little trivia bit, if you uh, play uh, banjo kazooie Nuts and Bolts, when you're building one of the uh, one of your little contraptions, there's a little uh, weapon called Weldar's Breath, which I've only just realised is from this game. I think you can, it tells you actually that Mumbo took this, took uh, this guy's head and made him into that weapon. I think it's pretty cool. Now that fan's turned off, you can go and... Uh, Get that little um, jiggy that he's been storing up there. 
so there we go. I hope that helped. Most probably not since most of everyone played it since it came out like 13 years ago, but 